Hello class, today I'm going to show you how to get PyCharm installed and licensed on your system. Account.jetbrains.com up here at the top, you see, before it says login, you can create an account here. Use your school email address, the nsd131.org, so that way you can get that license for free. Get that part set up, and then we're going to need to get um, JetBrains installed. Uh, so if we come out, you're going to look for a PyCharm. And if you just search PyCharm up here in the, uh, should come to the first one, go to download. You want to download the professional edition here. Get that downloaded. Once you have that downloaded, then you can search, um, we'll put up a new tab, PyCharm Student Free License. You'll see JetBrains Free Educational License. Go into that down below. It's going to hit Apply Now. It's going to come in. Now you're going to enter your information here. You already have your account set up, so you should be good. Um, you, don't, you know, Just answer the questions down through here. These don't really matter. Uh, besides this one, make sure that I'm a student. Email address again has to be your nsd131.org account. That will then get this set up for you so that you can use that. Once you have that installed and you get up, most likely it may ask for currently before you even get into here, but just in case, we're going to go to the help menu, come down to register the license on that. So when you use your username and, and password here, hit activate, it should do that automatically for you just by having the nsd131.org account, which will then get you licensed and ready to roll inside of PyCharm. Your name and email that you set up with, with uh, JetBrains, that will automatically license it um, and make that professional editions free for you.